clock ticking down, we're in Houston. It seemed that time was on Duncan's side in 2004, when his Spurs led the Rockets by 10, with just 49 seconds left to play. Houston Rockets, on the way to dropping to 8 and 12. All that remained was for time to wind down, but T-Mac refused to concede. We win games, it's when we're being who we are, and that means defensive-minded and tough. And although their offense has been atrocious tonight, they have gotten after it defensively. Yao Ming, now the follow. 74-66, the Rockets' all-time low. Well, that will be surpassed tonight as Patrick is able to hit off the steal. And it's a he did not get that play correct out of the timeout, and Popovich obviously upset with Manu. Here's McGrady for three. 35 seconds to go, and look to foul. Sora picks up number six. Brown continues to hit at the line. And the Spurs now lead by seven. Rockets looking for a quick shot. Bowen is all over. McGrady. Foul is picked up. It's a potential four-point play. Tracy McGrady from downtown. And Tim Duncan could not get out of the way. He's called for the foul. What a shot by McGrady. You'll see the screen by Yao Ming, which forces Duncan to help, and he just draws the contact and somehow gets it to go. Incredible shot by T-Man. To get the ball to Devin Brown, he's four for four here. High Larry inbounds into the backcourt. Needs some time. Parker chasing by McGrady. Now Brown. doubt that he was going to pull up from three and go for the win and why not unbelievable oh give me five i don't believe it i do not believe this the crowd is just going crazy my teammates are trying to chase me because i'm running and i'm trying to get away from them all those people who left they're driving home in their cars right now wondering what were we thinking i'm never ever thinking about missing the last second shot this is one of the greatest comebacks in rocket history. I have never seen anything like this. 